Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to remove the security tab from different files and folder property windows on your computer. So for example, if I were to create a new folder here and you right click on it and select properties, you see that there is a security tab. Well, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to turn that off. And this is more than likely going to be very beneficial for you know local user accounts where you don't want people messing around with the security permissions on folders. And it should be pretty straightforward. Now there, there is a group policy editor method that is generally a little bit easier, I would say. Since a lot of you guys aren't on Windows 10 Professional or higher editions, you won't have access to that. So we're going to have to just use the registry method for everybody for this tutorial. And that's what we're going to jump right into. So we're going to start off by opening up the start menu, type in regedit, R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best result should come back a registry editor. You want to go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you are prompted with a user account control screen, you're going to go ahead and select yes. And before you proceed in the registry, I would suggest you create a backup of it. So if anything were to go wrong, you could easily restore it back and or create the backup. It's very simple. You just would select the file tab and then export. File name, I normally recommend naming it the date in which you are making the backup. Export range, keep that at all and then save it to a convenient location on your computer. And if you ever need to import it back in, you could just select file and then import and navigate to the file location. So again, pretty straightforward process. And, and now we are ready to begin. So we want to start by double clicking on the HK current user folder and then follow that up by double clicking on the software folder. Same thing with Microsoft. Go down to Windows. Double click on that. Same thing for current version. And now there should be a policies folder under here. Right here. And now if you expanded policies there should be an explorer folder. However we don't have that in our case so we're going to have to create it. So in order to create the Explorer folder, you're going to have to right click on properties again if you try and expand it and there is no little arrow next to it. You're going to have to do this, which will be right clicking on the policies folder, selecting new, and then select key. Name this key Explorer exactly as you see it on my screen. Hit enter on your keyboard. Now on the right side, you want to right click in a blank area, select new, and then select the word 32 bit value. Name this value No Security tab. The first letter of each word should be capitalized here. Hit enter on your keyboard and now double click on it. Set the value data to 1. So delete the 0, type the number 1. Select OK. Now that you've done that, you will need to restart your computer for the change to take effect and that should be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do a positive to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.